This is a guide on how to, it's just like a little free traffic acquisition strategy. So I'm sure that people are both familiar with like Quora and Reddit. Um, and maybe there are some other like similar sites within your niche. Um, but these are like basically forum sites where people are going to ask questions. And what you can do is do like sitequora.com and then I can put in like LinkedIn marketing, for example, and I can find threads that maybe I want to go and answer in order to promote like my LinkedIn marketing plugin or things like that. Um, so this would be this was actually the first way that I ever grew my like Instagram business. Um, I would find threads on um, on Reddit related to Instagram marketing and then I was basically just going to recommend my own business. It was a very like simple thing and like you can buy up votes to put to boost your um your comments but um I used to get like three customers per day which was about $120 per day and, and when like you're first getting started making money online like even when you make your first $50 online um I just remember that feeling it's like crazy and um uh, so like one way to do it is just to like go and type in Google and like sitecora.com. It means it's only going to return um, the website Quora. That actually works with anything. It's just a, like um, it's just a way of filtering uh, what website you're returning. Um, but anyway, I um, this is actually an even better way of doing it. So we're going to come into like SEM rush. Um, you can get like a free trial in order to do this for, for seven days. Um, and that's more than enough time to get all the information that you need. And then you can just like cancel, cancel your subscription. So what we want to do is, um, find like a lot of, uh, results either, like we could do position number one, maybe like top three is quite a good way to go. Um, and what this is going to do is that was quite stupid. Um, so SEM rush is tracking all of these keywords and right now I'm, I'm going to, it's going to tell us all of the, um, I've just filtered 28 million keywords. Uh, that's why it's taking so long. That was a very silly thing to do. Um, <laughs> let me try and cancel that okay anyway so SEM rush is tracking like the keyword position of all of of like thousands of different websites so we can then query their database to get it to tell us um like the search volume and the ranking position of um various different uh Quora threads. We can do it for Reddit as well. And then basically we're just going to extract this data. Okay, here we go. Um, so I guess actually we can just, we can filter by Uh, position number one. So let's go for top three, I think is actually good enough. Um, hmm. Okay, let's open this up a little bit more then. Let's go into, as long as they're on like the first page, I guess, it would be quite a good a good starting point. Um, it's, this is also gonna completely depend on, um, 
on what uh, on what niche you're you're working it working on, um, like what the type of results that, that you're going to get. So, um, like keyword growth. So, for example, this like growth hacking Facebook groups is um, is ranking well on on search and so it's got like 1.2k views which is pretty good um because bearing in mind it, it only takes like a minute or two to um to write an answer for these questions so i would yeah it's it's just good to um to note all these down so the reason that i'm actually doing this research is for like our mvp for the um growth tool that we made um and um this is just like a free acquisition channel it's really good just to get it out of the way when you're like starting your your business um because it is just going to drive traffic through to you like forever so um it's it's not like really explosive growth or, or anything like that but it's it's a good acquisition channel and definitely something worth worth doing um so i'm just going to make a little air table i don't know if they have an api for doing this but i'm going to do it a little bit manually anyway um so core effects to answer okay let's um let me try this a little bit different I just need to see what type of search terms are um are like really relevant for us. Um not digital marketing. Let's do um let's do LinkedIn and we'll like filter down from there. LinkedIn marketing. Okay, so that gets quite a lot of that appears on search term LinkedIn marketing. What is LinkedIn marketing? So that is a great one. Every month this is getting 1900 search volumes. It ranks in position 8, which is it's okay, um, but it's, it's definitely a good starting point. Is LinkedIn Premium worth it? Um, it's quite annoying that they do that. Want to show a promotion on LinkedIn. So basically anything related to like LinkedIn marketing um, and terms like that are, are like just really relevant to us. Um, how to change LinkedIn courses, just like, uh, And like all of this traffic is going to add up very quickly. Um, schedule LinkedIn posts. That is a pretty good one because it means they're interested in content marketing. Um, so yeah, basically all I'm going to do is just note down all of these um, like I'll be here for a while, so I, I won't record the whole thing, but uh, essentially we're just going to note down all of the URLs that are interesting to us. I'll probably sit here for like five, six hours today um, just to get it all done. And I'll probably note down about a hundred different um, 
uh, threads that I need to answer. Um, and it, yeah, it's just a really easy way for us to start getting traffic. But um, essentially, that is what you do. This is obviously just running on, on Quora. You can also run on Reddit. Um, and uh, if or if there are like some other forums in like your niche, um, you can can definitely like run on on those as well. This will work on any website. Just these these two are like a good um, good starting point. Um, so yeah, um, I hope that makes sense. Essentially, this is just like filtering out and making sure that we're only commenting on high ranking. Um, Fred, uh, so we know that they're ranking on the first page, so it's likely to drive in traffic for us. Um, so yeah, I hope you found found that interesting and learned something new. Like I said, for any like any business at all, really should do this. Like you're going to get traffic driven in from very targeted traffic sources, um, but particularly like for actually launching a business, and if like you're tight on capital and haven't got money for doing ads and everything like that. This is a really good way to um, to get started. So, um, yeah, thank you very much for watching. As always, any questions, leave a comment and I will be um, be happy to help. Thank you for, for watching.